Yo, yo, yo! Good evening. How are we all doing? Are we doing well? Welcome to Acoustic Hour. Uh, let's mute that. Uh, we got a plectrum. I'm gonna stick it off. You'll be actually before we go any further, you'll be pleased to know we've got Laura in the house. Please. Hey, Laura's here. You've got fans, Laura, I know that, you've got fans. Right, let's kick this off with a bit of blues. <laughs> Hello to Ben. Better go in there. BB Ninja, thank you for being the sweetheart that you are. Uh, who else we got in here? Uh, I'm seeing Rory Holmes. Um, there was a lot of Stevie. I suppose there was a bit of Stevie Ray in there. Yeah, you can't you can't help have a bit of Stevie Ray uh, come out there. Mind that. Who is that? Ricardo. You're awesome, dude. And playing um, playing for you, accused me. Just made me even more. So oh, Ricardo, man, that's lovely. God bless you. This is the Ricardo chord. Um, right. Right. Actually, this is an even nicer one. That's a bit nice. That's a nice. That's the Ricardo chord. Bless you, man. Thank you so much. It's very sweet of you. Um, right. I'll, I'll go back to reading some more in a minute. Let me. Let me just play. Max sixty-five is holding a spare string for you. <laughs> yes. So uh, last time I did this uh, was it two weeks ago, wasn't it? I, uh, I snapped the string about to do the devils on my side and I was tuning the note down and yet it still snapped. How, has that ever happened to anyone? Let me know in the comment section below if you're a guitar player, has that ever happened? But uh, let's do another song. I'm gonna try and do some songs which I didn't do last time. Obviously that cover which I decided to do about an hour before. <laughs> so hence some of the cock ups, but hey, you know, go with it. But here's a little tune once I take a sip called Fantasy. Can't quite hear the crowd. There they are, there we go.
So how's everyone doing in day, day, yeah, audience, you can. <laughs> Technical difficulties behind the scenes. Uh, how's everyone doing on um, day, what is it, Laura, now? Day 20? Uh, 2012? No, day. Yeah, that's the day. Oh, is it, is it, what? We've been in quarantine for 2012 days. <laughs> and this is what I've had to put up with for 2012 days. But how's everyone doing in the, the lockdown? I've had a comment on the text. Oh, yes. So, unfortunately, I'm taking you over in terms of popularity. Okay. Um, I'm not at all surprised. Angie said, go, Laura. I'm your number one fan. Who said that? Angie. Oh, Angie, yeah. <laughs> and she has a request from her friend Sarah again. Okay. Sarah did request last week. She did. Um, we let her down, I think. But this no, time, she, she wanted Watchtower. Fair enough. Yeah. This week, she actually wants a Beatles song. Don't Let Me Down is the name of the song. Don't Let Me Down. Now, I used to do Don't Let Me Down many, many years ago. Um, hang on a minute. I've seen someone's been very nice. Who's that? That is Matt. Oh, Matt. Hello, mate. Bless you. I'm like, thanks for the good vibes. Thank you for the good, beautiful generosity. Bless you, man. Thank you so much. Um, Don't Let Me Down. Now, I've got, I actually wrote a set list this time. I write a set. But I do like a challenge. So don't let me down. Um, okay, let's give it a go. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> and just for Sarah, yeah? Is it Sarah? Yeah. Um, don't let me down. Oh, it's high. Me. She told me, girl. 
I'd never have somebody ever through me see what's going on here. Again, Ricardo and Matt, bless you. Thank you so much. That's very sweet. Um, where are we? Where we got in? Uh, where are you all from as well? It'd be great to know where everyone's from. Hello, Jason. Um, I hope you've got some spare... Oh, right. Okay, I'm a bit far behind it. Um, what's that? Got a few here. Go on. From Carl Taylor. Oh! Can you do your shirt buttons up? It's making my wife hot under the collar. From Bradfield Park. <laughs> <laughs> And someone called Zena Dean. Golden Brothers, just think you could have been living it up in Hamburg. Yes, who, who said that? Zena Dean. Zena Dean. Zena Dean 12? <gasps> I don't know who that is. Zena I don't know History who that is. Guess. But yes, I was, um, it's quite fitting that I did a Beatles song. Because yeah, I was, um, I think I put a thing on Instagram that I was going to be doing on my stag do this weekend. Because believe it or not, the, the voice you hear behind, we, we are... We're engaged to be married, and uh, but that's been kind of uh, changed because of a, a certain uh, well situation that I'm in right now. So, uh, but yes, I was. But the stag deal I was going to was in Hamburg. So um, yeah, it would have been good. But uh, my brother uh, kind of got the stag do party together. Um, well, about half of them. Some of them are on daddy duties and stuff like that. But uh, he did a little quiz and we had about a three, three hour Zoom chat. Mm -hmm. But it was all very good. Um, but yes, Carl, um, I can't do shirts start past this. I really, it's not like um, a vanity thing. I just hate this. I can't, that, that ain't me. I mean, look at it, mean, nah, but that's me. I just, it just, it flows. So if um, Mrs. Turner is getting, um, <laughs> <laughs> Go in, don't look at me like that. <laughs> right, you're from Pennsylvania, wicked. Atlanta, or lots of Americans. Houston, Houston Texas. Oh man, I'd love to go to Texas. Oh, Tim Harrison, you beautiful man, how you doing? You're keeping me from doing yard work. <laughs> um, right, Chris let's Clover do. Chris did a nice one. Sorry? Chris Clover, great job here on Don't Let Me Down, Mike. You surely didn't. Oh. Singing along. You flirt, you flirt. <laughs> Well, I'll tell you what, what's next on my set? Uh, let's, do a, uh, let's do an oldie. Woo! This is an oldie where you guys come from. Oh, it's a Spotify guy. Oh, oh Spotify's gone. But um, this is a song of my second EP, Faded Away, and it goes something like this. Page 
Looking out of a book and now I TV seems to be broken, but what needs to happen now? We need to reset the skybox on the switch at the back. That's what needs to be happening. <laughs> Laura's being very cheeky behind the camera. <laughs> very, oh, very cheeky. Brad Garlinghouse's protruding right ear has asked for, can you play Nothing Compares to You by Prince? Hey, it's my birthday. Oh, it's his birthday. Oh my, oh, don't do that to me, Brad. Um, Stephen James is here. I love him. Um, you know what? Right. So, last time I had a couple of songs which I um, couldn't do because I wanted to do it properly. And I'm going to do these later on. There'll be two coming up. Um, now, Nothing Compares to You is an amazing song. And that one, I don't want to blag. So... I will probably, we do this again. It seems to be every two weeks we do this. So, Brad, in two weeks' time, on this next one, Laura will make a note. And uh, <laughs> I will do uh, my version of Nothing Compares to You by The Amazing Prince. But um, I don't want to, I will butcher it, you know. It's been seven hours and 16 days. Something like that, you know. And then, did you take your love away? Maybe you shave your head as well, do Sinead O'Connor. I don't think I'll shave my head, no. I don't think I'll... Oh, I don't think I do that. He's just said, okay, man, living on a prayer instead. Persistent, I'll give you that. He is. It's his <laughs> birthday, isn't it? 
Oh, God. Oh. This one you want a load of reverb, really. Time I used to work on the docks. Junior's been on track, he's down on his lucky stuff. So tough. And Gina works at that on her days. Working for a man, she brings home a pay for love. For love. You said you got a hold on. Gina with Tommy Whisper Gina. It's okay. That tickled Laura. <laughs> if you're gonna do if you're gonna do Bon Jovi, you gotta do it with the pure cheese factor. Got to. It's, it's, it would be a cardinal sin if you didn't. Mmm. Alright, let's see what's going on. Who's here? Thank you for everyone tuning in. If you just tuned in, hi, where have you been for the last uh, 24 minutes? Um you keep, uh, the, the, the old man, I'm massively behind. Um, um, where are we here? Sounding good, my Any chance of times? Oh, God, we're getting all the requests coming now, aren't we? Maybe we should do a request on Instagram before the next gig, and then you can prep. That would be more fun. So this is why every man needs a Laura. Because <laughs> she's just, she's on it. I wouldn't think like that. I wouldn't think like that. Turn. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Well, I know, well, no, I won't say that. I was going to be rude. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, if you, um, yeah, DM me on Instagram. Go on Mike Buddy Official. And I will try and get, because some, like, some of like, the Beatles one, you can blag. Live on the prey, you can blag. Foo Fight, I do, I have got a Foo, I've done a Foo Fighters before. I did a gig once and someone requested it. And, uh, but I had the lyrics, you know, the cheat sheets. But um, I will, we'll see about that for another time, you know. But everyone's all good. Uh, oh, the devil! No, what the devil's on my side will be coming up because it needs to be 
you know, um, done properly for the last time with the string break, you know. It weren't very good. Gita's here. Hello, Gita. Lovely to see you. Thank you for joining, my little sweetheart. Laura's uh, playing on the comments. Laura, are you? Are you in the comments? Laura's in the comments. Oh, Tim, you got a fan, Tim. That's it. She's going to hunt you out. She's going to hunt you out. Uh, your favourite riff. My favourite riff. Um, oh, God. Probably something like, um, I don't know, actually. I don't know if I've got a favourite riff. Um, bon Jovi's in my head, so... That's quite a good one. Uh, right, let's do it. Okay, I'm gonna do a song which um, I, I went through the archive. Yeah, yeah. I went through the archive, Laura. Yeah, she's shocked by this. And um, this is a tune called uh, Day Like Today, which I think I wrote when I was about 21. So uh, again, only three years ago. Um, <laughs> But um, but yeah, day like today. Let's see if I can remember the words. And um, I was certainly probably very influenced by the Beatles when I wrote this. Uh, you'll see what I mean by the chords. But yeah, day like today. Haven't played this song in a long time. <laughs> Please don't. 
Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> a day like today. We did have a request on the text. Oh, we got a request for text, apparently. Um, from a DJM. Who's that? Oh, right, yeah, yeah. He's too shy to ask. Yeah. But he's really after walking in Memphis. Oh, my God. <laughs> Could be one for next time, I got Yeah, I mean, he's a... I mean, Laura, please make a note of the... I mean... Mm -hmm. I've been walking in Memphis. What's the, mm, 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 mm. I'm usually quite good at, um, if I can hear a song, I can usually play it, but, um, mm. what's the, mm, 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 mm. Okay, so, oh, oh, I don't know, it's an E. Sounds like it's an E. But uh, I, I, unfortunately, I don't, I don't know that at all. <laughs> at all. I'm sorry. Uh, was it D D? DJM. But we have also had a bit of love on the uh, the chat for Walking in Memphis as well. A few people said great request. Really? Well, one person. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say. I mean, who did that? That was. Um... Oh, please, someone tell tell us who who sang Walking in Memphis. Who did it? Who did it? Who did it? Oh, I don't know. Ah, someone must know. There's a lag. Uh, three years ago, that's, that makes me 28. Oh, Gracie. Oh, Gracie's here. Hello, Gracie. Uh, good, I can't see at all. Hi from the Philippines. Um, yes, uh, Birchie. Fredication. Mark Cohn, walking around the face. Oh, oh, didn't I know that? Hello, Michael Collins, just joining in. How you oh. doing? Jason Bourgeois discovered uh, your channel through Pete Thorne. Oh, cool. Pete Thorne is a lovely, beautiful man. Um, that's amazing. Yeah, I, actually, I only say that because myself, Pete, and a host of other really, really great guys and guitar players and guys on YouTube, we're all um, doing a little collaboration uh, thing um, for In The Blues coming up very soon. And uh, it's fresh in my mind because I recorded my part earlier today. So, um, but yeah, so I'm looking forward to hearing what everyone's done. But, um, but no, thank you. I'm glad that you, uh, you found me. Laura's itching to tell me something. Yes. Really sorry, I actually got the thread slightly confused. Jason was talking to Ben Coons. Oh. And he right. discovered Ben Coons through Peak of the One. Oh, right. So, oh, I got it wrong. Sorry. Oh, see, that's just, that's nice, just made nice sense. I mean, it's a, it's a shout out anyway for uh, Pete. But yeah, see, <laughs> when I was. Uh, Giving all this complimentary to uh, Laura, uh, and then she ruins it. She'll pull it back. That oh, she looks all sad now. Oh, don't worry, don't worry, Laura. You can't be perfect all the time. Yeah, you're doing a good job. Anything from the band, Mike? I know I don't know anything by the band. Uh, oh, Jason. Oh, Jason. I've seen your name before, mate. Yeah, I've seen you before. Uh, right, let's do another tune. Unless I'll just check anything in case um, anything's been missed. Uh, thank you again, BV Ninja, for being marvellous. Uh, a blue, a blues or e blue. I know what um, is that, Erman? I did. I started off with before you accused me. I started off with that. Um, right, let's do uh, let's do a bit of a rocky one. You feeling a rocky one or? Pardon? You feeling a bit of a rocky one? Always. I'm sure the neighbours are too. <laughs> yeah, well, so that we don't um, disrupt the neighbours, I because I've got a thing about I bang my foot, keeping the beat, and uh, I currently have a pillow or cushion underneath my foot right now, so uh, <laughs> that's keeping it. Right, so this is a song called Strange Little Fantasy. Thank you, thank you.
think you're made to last I see the way you act with all the others Make them shake and break like glass You got the walk, you got the talk, you got the action And you're nasty and you're rude You flip them off with a look of love and passion And the spell is on me too You're just a damn perfect wonder I wonder what you're thinking now too Broken eyes have left you feeling all dirty A twist of fate is in your hands You always try to be that cool chick in the mirror Nevertheless, you're never bland You got them running, got them jumping, got them chasing Little finger going round You cast a smile to accommodate your actions And I see that I'm dumbfound You're just a damn perfect wonder I wonder what you're thinking Yo, strange little fantasy. <laughs> the, the, the line, um, I've already met your sister. I guess I'm just as bad as you too. Uh, I did get a little look there by my lovely lady. <laughs> but I wrote that way before I met Nora. <laughs> um, and I said that this is very dark and gloomy. Yeah. Some flame emojis. Ooh. We like the flame. Oh, he oh. said, you can't be my strange little fantasy. But maybe he meant to say you can be. Can you be? <laughs> where, where is that? Let me find that. Let me um, find that. Um, oh, you can't be my strange little fantasy. Oh. oh. TBC. T <laughs> <laughs> TBC indeed. Oh, dear. But no, thank you again. Thank you again. I hope you enjoyed it. That uh, that song. There is a video of me uh, doing an acoustic version of this. Probably back in oh man, 2014. And I played with my band a few times. So any kind of live footage you uh, which is dotting around on my channel. Uh, there's a cool video. Um, I think it's called like Mike Bradley takes over Yamaha for the day or something. Um, put Mike Bradley Yamaha and you'll see picture of the band and we're playing and there's a full live version of that and we kind of go off and do lots of improv, improv, improvisation going on, you know. Um, Audrey, Alex, I reckon I'd ask to Ben, um, but uh, can we hear some, it's a Hendrixing acoustic. What, you know what, who said that? War, war, war. Oh, yeah, war, war. Um, I have next, let me give a little tune up on my set list. So, as I was mentioned earlier about requests, sometimes I can blag it, sometimes um, not so much. Um, but somebody asked for uh, Boulder's Love last time. So, I'm gonna, sorry, what was that? No, oh, um, So, I'm gonna give it a go, but um, I do need some cheat sheets.
Um, We've also had um, a question, what is that green bottle? I can, do you want me to talk through that one? Yeah, please do. Um, so this is actually some of our wedding booze um, in a secure location at our home, which mm -hmm. I won't disclose, just mm -hmm. in case. Um, we've got a lot of, lot of booze for our wedding, which we're... Seem to be dipping in and out of now and again. Yeah, well, I'm... <laughs> see, I'm good. And I say, don't touch it. And then Laura... Um, Laura's a fiddler. <laughs> Laura likes... No, is there something to pick? She'll pick it. You know, is there something... No, she's, and so she's like, oh, let's have a few. So last night, I had my kind of um, uh, Zoom stag do thing because if you've just joined i was going to be on my stag do in hamburg today uh, i meant to fly out yesterday but alas that got kind of cancelled and laura's like and then we had no beers and laura goes well go go to the you know uh secure location we have um which isn't far and uh you know get get a couple of, you know get some beers i was like but i don't want to open the box because then you know when it comes to the wedding you know it's all going to come she's like i'll stop being so tight blah 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 i was like oh, all right so i couldn't bother to open it so i bought a whole box of uh bex and um got i think probably had you know about three or four each last night <laughs> so yeah you know it's a 20 is it 20 to a box so it's like we've got to redo that. But, um, but anyway, how do we get on to that? Oh, someone asked about the green bottle. So yes, yeah, so I've, got, I've got the naughty bottle, cheeky beer, and then I've got um, a nice glass of water in my uh, nice Ernie Ball glass. Shout out to the lovely people at Ernie Ball because they're very supportive to me. Mm. So, as I was saying, um, I got asked for a request for uh, Boulder's Love and the words in this, man, I, I need cheat sheets because there's a lot of words. If, if Does anybody know the words to Boulder's Love? Let us know in the comment section because you will understand there's a real sh 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 A lot of words, a lot of words. So, uh, you know, uh, and this is when Jimmy really loved his colours, you know. Towering in shiny metallic purple armour, Queen Jealousy, Envy waits behind him, her fiery green gown sneers at the grass. You know, he was a genius, very good poet. So, um, this is my uh, take on the Jimi Hendrix classic, Bogus Love. Let's do a little intro.
Annoyingly, I had before you uh, accused me lyrics up still with the boulders uh, love. So, uh, oh well, we blagged it. I remembered yellow is not so mellow, the fact he's trying to say and all that stuff. Hopefully it's all right. Gotta love Jimmy. I mean, you did have one comment that said it's got nothing on John Mayer. Might have been from me. <laughs> Was it generally from you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, considering... Laura is probably one of the biggest John Mayer fans. Um, what's that fair play? I hear John was in the Bahamas. Oh, right, tell me something. Ben was saying, I prefer Mike, plus Mike will actually hang with me at Nam. Yeah, <laughs> there was no John this year at Nam, was there? You know, and I missed him last year because I was having an in and out. Uh, not an in and out, where was we? Oh, God, this is when I need Sam. What's it called? Thank IHOP. He was in IHOP. Me and my mate Sam, he was in IHOP. And. Um, I, 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 the first now I went to was 2019, and uh, I, I was going as a PRS uh, guest. Uh, the lovely Jean sorted me out, and um, so I would have met him if I had my organisation skills in. But uh, yeah, me and Sam went to IHOP and had some pancakes and a burger. What a lovely combination! But when you're in America, that's what you do, isn't it? You know. And then uh, we saw my buddy, actually Sam's face drop. We saw my mate, Michael uh, Palmer, I can never say his surname, Guitar Gate, Michael Palmasino. Saw his uh, Instagram and Sam's face just dropped. And I was like, what's up? And he's like, Mike's with John Mayer. So we uh, <laughs> woofed down our pancakes, threw like $50 on the table, bombed it. And of course, you know, it, it was like half an hour later or something like that, he was gone. So, um, John missed out on meeting me. <laughs> That's how I look at it. Yes, Laura. Yes. I've, I've just got one lovely message. Yes. That I think I should read to you. Go on. Uh, is it somebody from DMB 2040? This on YouTube, yeah? Yeah. yeah. He said, by the way, love your channel, man. You play everything I love and inspire me to pick up the guitar more than anyone else on YouTube. Also, your attitude is the best. Keep it up, love from America. I thought that was really nice. That is beautiful. What's your name again, sorry? Um, D, well, he or she, DMB2040. DMB2040. Honestly, that, that's lovely to hear. That really is. And, um, and all the support I get from everyone is, is, it really means a lot. I mean, the fact that there's 64, you know, pretty much strangers watching me, which is, um, you know, beautiful. Really, really nice. So, so Laura's giggling. So, what, 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 what have you seen? We've got another request from a VIP, uh, Join up, Mr. Andy Bradley. All right. Do you know you make my dreams come true? <laughs> Who did that? You make my dreams come true. <laughs> do, 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 do. Oh, oh, who did it? Yeah, you make my. Do, 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 do. A horror notes, yeah. I have played that before, actually. I don't think I have actually. Well, well, well. Um, Andy Bradley is in the house. That is my dear brother. If uh, if you all do or don't know, well, uh, he's being cheeky. Um, but uh, what's going on uh, with that electric set? Right, let's see if I'm missing anything here. But, uh, and see some names on me. Oh, Audrey, I remember that before. Ben, uh, ben Coons is always the towering support in the YouTube community. Um, right, what's next on my set list? I have, oh, I've got, um... <laughs> I think I meant to write meet again, but I wrote beat again. <laughs> 
I think I was, I, when I wrote the set, our Wi-Fi went and I was angry with our router. So I probably was just, you know, saying many swear words under my breath when I wrote that. But um, yeah, this is a tune called Meet Again from um, my, this is what I have to see. Uh, EP available on all online streaming platforms and websites such as mikebradymusic.com. Um, but a yeah, nice little song called Meet Again and um, and I hope one day we do meet again and we're not stuck inside caves for the rest of our lives. Um, Thank you, Bam Muzzy. Bam Muzzy, you've been a lovely supporter of mine for a long time. I recognise your name. The legends are true, Andy. <laughs> oh, Andy Bradley's getting involved in the chat. Um, oh, yeah. Someone said you are so loved up. Oh, Andy, thank you. Look can be deceiving, whoever said that. <laughs> I also had a request for a duet next time. Sonny and Cher or Elton and Kiki D. Oh. <laughs> Did you put that request in, Laura? A friend of mine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
I mean, who would like to see Laura sing? Actually, first of all, maybe you're, at the moment, Laura's an, an enigma. I can't even say the word. Ben Tong said, why is your better half not on camera? This is it. So I'll tell you what, give the videos a thumbs up if you want to see Laura on camera for the next stream. Give the videos a thumbs up. <laughs> ben Tong's and if, for a friend. If we, um, if we get enough, we'll see if we can get the, the enigma that is Laura. I won't say your surname. Laura. Soon to be Laura Bradley. Hey. Hey, hey. Um, I did just see a very nice message from Jonas Phyllis. Um, Hi, great songs you are playing. What do you think of Thin Lizzy? Is it something you like or not your thing? Um, of course, yeah, I like Thin Lizzy. Um, but I've never really... Um, I, I don't own an album of, of theirs at all. I remember um, in my early years of playing... Um, so I started playing guitar a long time ago in 1996 when Laura was like this high, you know what I mean? She was, and she was probably still a pain in the ass back then. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Love is in the air. Um, but uh, I remember Total Guitar magazine, they did like, I often talk about this, like classic tracks and stuff like that, you know. And they did Don't Believe a Word, you know. So like that. And I remember the solo, first time, so I heard it first, um, a guy called Richard Barrett. He still does the Guitarist magazines. He's a wicked guitar player. Check out Guitarist Magazine's YouTube channel if you don't already. And you'll see this guy, Richard Barrett. And I remember he did all, did all the videos there. I can hear Laura chuckling. I'm intrigued to know what's going on now. Um, but uh, I'm going to tell my story. But, um, so I heard his version first, and I heard that, that wah solo, that big tremolo, and I was like, oh, that's so cool. And I remember saying to my mum, I'm going to learn that, and mum was like, a bit hard, isn't it? <laughs> As always, my mum would bring things back to earth. She was the one, you know, uh, if you haven't heard the story, I'd be singing uh, in my bedroom when I was a kid. And uh, one of my favourite singers is Richard Ashcroft, and I would have been singing one of his songs. Maybe I should do one of those next time, when it's Richard Ashcroft's song next time. But I'll never forget Mum, and I don't know if my mum's watching. She was earlier. Oh, she, oh, oh hi Mum. So, I, so I'm going to say this to you, Mother. I will never forget being at, back at the home, you know, back in the 90s home, and me playing, my, I would have my classical guitar, and I was singing a Richard Ashcroft song or the verse song, and mum comes in and she goes, stick to the guitar. <laughs> and, and I remember my little 14 year old heart and the stuff, you know that, that sinking feeling you get. Well, mother, I love you and all, but that hurt. I've snapped my arm. I've had a rugby ball thrown in my eye. I've been smacked around the head with a didgeridoo. That, those are all true, what I just said, but that hurt. <laughs> Well, I forgive you, Mum. I forgive you. Um, oh, and actually, talking of Mum, I know it's her favourite song. So, last time I did this, we had a string snap. So, this is when you've got to be on the sound effects door. That's when you want like a. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But hopefully, this will not be the case. But while I'm tuning, Laura, what was making you laugh? Um, I was getting quite a lot of love actually in the comments. Oh, I'm rightly so. Cora is lovely. I'll take the nice. mick out of her, but she's nice. she's not a bad gal. Make me very happy. What else did we have? Yeah, it looks like a duet's going to happen, so... Okay, well, I mean... I better tune up my best voice. I mean, I'm down <laughs> for that, but I think more importantly, are you down for that, Laura? <laughs> I mean... I mean, my voice does sound like, is it Cameron Diaz in My Best Friend's Wedding? When she does the karaoke. <laughs> Cameron Diaz, why can't I see Cameron Diaz? Oh. From the mask. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. I just don't know what to do. That one. I did actually record because Laura <laughs> is massively into um, Elton John at the moment. And uh, Elton John and Flip. life. Well, yeah, not, not recently, it's like all the time. And now since we saw Rocket Man the other day, She's even more. So if it's not Elton John, it's uh, Fleetwood Mac. And uh, I was in the living room, and she was in the kitchen, I think, sort of at dinner or something. And, um, listen to And uh, she was just singing this damn bloody song all the time. And uh, <laughs> I did record it. 
on my phone, but I decided not to put it on Instagram. But maybe I should. <laughs> Double check this, sorry, Stein. So this song I'm gonna do is The Devil's On My Side, which I will dedicate to my lovely mother. Um, and it's, um, if you're wondering what I'm, I'm tuning it down a tone, basically. Um, it just suits, it suits it all better that way. Um, so yeah, last time uh, in the last live stream, uh, I snapped the string doing this, and um, when you go straight away from acoustic to telly on something like this, it's like, ah, ah, it threw me. So um, let's do it properly. Let's see if I can remember the words, because I'm terrible and I don't rehearse. Um, but yeah, this is The Devil's On My Side, off my first EP, and uh, it goes something like this. Talking to myself again, I'm bored of what I say. I sit and wait patiently for you to come my way. But in the meantime, I would like to my way. Will the devil walk away? Would it leave my side? A rain cloud offers over me in the sunshine. I'm trying to find a reason. Why am not in my life? Behind my mask, behind my ways, behind the complications that seem to come my way. Is my soul laid bare for you? Every time I walk to be life feels down and blue. So again, I feel the devil's on my side. Thank you very, very much. Had a lovely message just then from James Beckley. It's in his top 25 most played on iTunes. Ah, that's lovely to know. Oh, and Rory Holmes, just to let you know, we've just reached 3,000 pounds. Oh, Rory. Rory Holmes. 
Rory Holmes is a beautiful young lad. He really is. And um, Rory, again, like I said last time, please put a link to your Facebook um, page of your charity you're doing. That is amazing, man. That's amazing. I've been seeing some of the videos you've been posting on there from people putting submitting their riffs. I know I said I will, and I will. It's just been a crazy couple of weeks, but I will. I will, I promise. Um, I was thinking, actually, because someone messaged me on Instagram and actually, as my brother's here, I'll give a shout out to him. Because someone messaged me um, about that song. I should tune up while I talk about this. Um, and they were asking uh, about the video and saying, oh, how much did you pay to get that done? And, you know, who, all that kind of stuff, you know, who, who, who edited all that together, you know, what company? And I kind of laughed because uh, myself and my lovely brother, we did that. Well, I say we, Andy is very good at editing. And uh, if you don't follow my brother on YouTube, do. Um, Andy, put your link in <laughs> to, your, to your channel. Uh, he's got two, he's got a gaming one and he's got like a travel and comedy one. But um, anything I know about editing, I kind of nick from Andy. And, um, but we spent about eight hours um, editing that video and we filmed, and, and just Andy and I filmed it. We went to a park, which is not far from here. And um, I kind of had in my head what I wanted to do. And um, Andy's there. And Andy looked like uh, an actual little director. Could he had his, no, Woody hat on. It was like February, it was freezing. And rucksack, he's all kind of loaded up and tripods and stuff like that. And, um, and we shot it all. And then when it came to editing, we realised we probably should have shot more, but we just... Excuse me, we just got through it, but um, but yeah, and then we connected our Mac to like the TV back at my mum's house, and um, yeah, we spent about eight or nine hours, I think, over a couple of days editing that video. So if you haven't seen the video, do check it out. And I've got to give props to Andy because um, he he's very good with his editing skills, and um, he's probably got a lot better since then because a few years ago. Now. Your mum um, gave a response as well. She said, made you even stronger to make you what you are now. Oh, regarding the singing? Yeah. All right then, Mum. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you cheeky monkey. I'll never forget it. Be on the bed. You just stick to the guitar. <laughs> All right, Mum. Thanks. But uh, again, thank you everyone for uh, joining me this evening. How long have we been going for? Oh, over an hour and ten. We've got... We've got, oh, we're gonna have to wrap it up soon. We've got a, we've got a Thai takeaway coming in in about 20 minutes. So, um, oh, what should I do? Right, okay. First of all, if anybody's got any questions, I will quickly, I will go through them now. Oh, oh. hey Tom, was the Devils on my side used on a movie or TV soundtrack? It, it wasn't, but if you know anybody who would like to use it, I could do with some sync money right now. <laughs> so, um, but no, um, I do strongly think that a certain pop star ripped off my song. Uh, I'm not going to say his name, but um, it's, it's, it's uncanny. I mean, he's a big pop star, he's, he's big. And I had done um, a little bit of work. I say work, I, I did a gig once with this guy um, who wrote a lot of songs for this guy's band they were in. So that's my little, I'm not saying that is the case, but it's the same, oh, Laura's saying don't say it. I won't say it, but someone ripped off myself. Uh, <laughs> and someone wants to know what's in our food order. I've gone for a chicken pad thai, and Laura's gone for, I don't know what you've gone for. Oh, you should know. Um, a Thai red curry, and then we've got some Cheeky mixed hors d'oeuvres to share. Mixed hors d'oeuvres to share, yes. I think this is the same. We last did ordered a tie on New Year's Eve. I mean, watch It too, and it, which is good, long film. And tonight we're gonna do watch. Ma, is it Mar? Yeah. By oh, Jordan Peele. Yeah, the guy did right. Get Out. If you haven't seen Get Out, it's an amazing film. Um, but uh, yeah, so I think we'll do that this evening. But yeah, and it's coming for nine o'clock, which is in. 17 minutes. So um, let me have a little quick look what's going on here. Um, Rory Holmes are the first comment I see. We're enjoying this is what a way to spend my Saturday night. That's amazing, Rory. Um, great songs you're playing. Oh, sorry, I'm back here. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Uh, what is going on? Uh, oh, someone's put, 
I've you lost it. You were saying bringing Mike too while you eat your dinner. Yeah, I should. <laughs> I should, shouldn't I? You know, I've lost him actually. He escaped. And I need to find him. He's escaped after all this kind of pandemic thing going on. <laughs> so, um, I mean, look out your windows. He, he, he could be there. So I need to hunt him out. <laughs> And then I'll get him back because I think a strap versus a silver sky video needs to be done. But I don't have any straps at here at my place at the moment. Um, so um, <laughs> I need to get back to get a strap. Um, but I did see someone say something about... Um, Neil McCormack said, all right, Mikey? Who said that, sorry? Neil McCormack. Neil McCormack. Oh, Ben Tom. Ben Tom, Ben Tom. Oh, Ben Tom to offset music <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, that helps a little bit. I got I got this behind when I was telling the story and Laura's like, no, I could Laura's probably just no. thinking, not now, not now. But I may take things further. But I've been saying it for about three years. <laughs> Laura's just sighing now. <laughs> but Ben uh, was it Ben Tom? But yeah. Thank you so much, man. Truly means a lot. God bless you. Thank you. Um I did see see I'm sure I saw someone said something about Andrew practicing guitar. Yeah, they said how's Andrew getting on? Um, wait, I want to know who said it. Um, it's a long way down. Uh, and Tim Harrison doesn't want you to go because then you'll have to go and do yard work. Yeah. <laughs> Tim Harrison is a lovely guy. He's, he's, you mean a lot to me, Tim. You're, you're such a big supporter to me. Um, Andy and practicing guitar, uh, or play, never mind practicing, picking up the guitar. My cousin was on here earlier as well. I'm going to say this to you. Could you got time? There's, there's no, there's no words. There's a Johnny Depp Instagram. Johnny Depp's on Instagram now, and he said there's no such thing as bored, and it's true. You can't, especially in this day and age. In the '90s, when we were kids, yeah, you could get bored a little bit, um, but there's too much to do now. But um, Andy has not picked up the guitar. I don't think. Um, I don't know. You tell us, Andy. How long's it been? Year and a half. I'm seeing is that isn't it all major <laughs> coming up right now? Um, but I think it's, it's been a while uh, since Andrew has played the guitar. I've been nagging at him to play the guitar uh, because um, actually, selfishly, those videos, what we did together, did quite well. <laughs> so I'd like to do a few more of them, I think, you know. <laughs> so um, obviously we can't be together at the moment, but um, yeah, we'll see. What's Laura chuckling about? No, BB Ninja said um, he believes that Mike Tears with John Mayer in his holiday home in the Bahamas. It could be, <laughs> couldn't he? he right. could, that rascal could have got with John. And then I'm, the poor <laughs> sap Mike, has been um, you know, stuck here in lovely Surrey. But yes, could be. Uh, what else is people saying here? Um, can you do a new guitar tour? Um, yeah, I should do, Andrew. I get asked a lot of questions um, actually about this guitar and I was thinking about dedicating a whole video talking about this in more detail. Um, I think the last guitar, well the only guitar tour video I've done was actually when I bought my 345, so 2016, so yeah. Um, but I will wait until I can get all my guitars because I am, you know, obviously in this isolation thing so and I'm playing it properly so. Um, no, playing by the rules properly, so I'll hold out. You've got something to say, Dean? No, oh, I just right. wondered if this was your last song. I think it's going to have to be my last song, I'm afraid. Uh, got to let it go a while to recoup uh, at a late date. Stop being seen. Oh, I don't know if that's to me or not. I think it was just regarding um, music thievery. Oh, right. Yeah, the thieves are out there, man. The thieves are out there. But um, I'm going to do one more song, then I'll check on some comments and stuff. Um... What should I end on? Um, I was going to do... Uh, what are you feeling, Laura? Higher or shiver? You did shiver last week. I did do shiver last time, yeah. And I ended with shiver last time, so let's end with higher. What about that lovely song you were playing the other day? Oh, uh, end on a softie? Yeah. I think everyone needs a bit of a All right. Um, so, um, this is dedicated to... Carl and Holly. Um, actually, that they put a request in, didn't they, last time? No, this isn't the song I was talking what about. What was we talking yeah. about? Oh, that one. But maybe do that next time. I think so I'll do that one next do. time because I've got a tune. It's, it's, I write songs and sometimes I'm like, that's too damn high to sing. 
Um, and so I'd have to tune down to E flat for that one. But um, I'll do that next time. Uh, so I think I want to make this a, uh, a recurrence. So every two weeks, every week, I think people might get a little bit sick and tired of me. Uh, <laughs> but every two weeks, I will, um, I'll do this little acoustic gig and um, we'll, see, we'll see if we get Laura in front of the camera next time. We'll see. Matt's gone to grab his lighter, so you better do a softie. All right. So this is, uh, this is a cover, actually. And uh, it was requested last time. Um, by my the lovely Carl and Holly, and I sang at their wedding, and um, it's called "Can't Help Falling in Love" by the the great man, my first musical hero, idol, Elvis Presley. I've never ever said that, but Elvis, I was a huge Elvis fan when I was a kid. So um, uh, let's see if I can remember it and the chords. Uh, not like that. Thank you very much. Carl sent you a lovely little dancing pair. In. Oh, Carl! Oh, bless you, man. Oh, bless you. Bless you. <laughs> dancing pair. He said, we've donated some moolah. Thank you. You've made someone very happy. I said, I hope they were dancing and smooching. Yes. Carl, hope this gets you lucky tonight. <laughs> um. <laughs> you know, come on. Come on, Ollie. Give the kid a favour. <laughs> it's probably too far. Laura's shocked now. Laura... <laughs> um, but no, very Carl, man, honestly. That's very sweet of you. Very, very sweet. God bless you. Um, uh, Neil McCormick. Is, Mil, is Neil Steve's related to Steve at all? Uh, keep up the great videos. But, um, just out of curiosity. Oh, I'll take Grace here. Oh, look, look. I, I can't go in front of the I can't I can't do it. Laura. Don't I can't. Get off the two seconds. All right, in a minute. Let me turn the camera because she's cam, Laura, Laura's an enigma. Can you turn it off? No, I've not turned it off, but you're not in shot. Don't worry. Don't worry, Laura. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> go on, Laura. Our, our takeaway has come. Laura's got right. Laura has left the building. Uh, <laughs> I think mainly because she's basically dressed in her pajamas. Um, but I will uh, take over here for a minute, but a uh, banter, yes. Um, but honestly, uh, Matt, thanks Mike and Laura, this was awesome, looking forward to the next one, stay safe. Thank you, Matt, thank you so much. And um, 
I will enjoy the takeaway, yeah. Uh, Ricardo, thank you so much. You know, to everyone who was very kind and, you know, in the, in the, in the little tip back, what was it? Super chat, that's what it's called. I'm, I'm terrible with live streaming. I need to live stream more and get with the lingo. But, um, but no, you're, it means so much to me. And everyone just tuning in, it really means a lot. Um, and, you know, I'm, I am a giggy musician and, um, you know, that classic, um, the classic tale, how do you make a musician complain? You give them a gig, you know? So us musicians, we often complain, oh, I've got to do this, I've got to drive, you know, four hours, well, eight hour round trip or something, you know? But um, I really, really miss playing live, I really do, you know? If it's not session stuff or even function gigs I do, and obviously my own stuff, I really, really miss it. So, and being on a stage in it. So that's why I kind of thought, you know, I start these little acoustic gigs and stuff. Um, so yeah, I want to make it an occurrence, I think every two weeks and, um, I'll, I've made it, I'll, I believe Laura, or I'll watch this back a little bit and I'll take the notes people said about, um, some requests they were like, and I will try and get them in as I did today with Bold of Love and Can't Help Falling in Love. Um, and, uh, yeah, we'll try and make it happen again in two weeks time. So put it in your diet. What's two weeks? Two weeks will be... Will it be April still or May? It'll be, oh, wow, it'll be the 2nd of May. 2nd of May. And I'll tell you what, the 12th of May is the anniversary when I left school. Come the 12th of May or I left school a long time ago. I was in a gig. The big question I get asked is like, how old are you? And I was about to say how long I've left school. Um, so I thought I'd just stop there. But um, wow, 2nd of May. Um, but yeah, that'll be when the next live stream is. Sorry, let me check. Uh, Brent, oh, Brent, Tom, bless you, man. Thank you so much. Um, Brent, Tom. Uh, what's that? Not Brent, Tom, it's Ben. Oh, Bent Tom. I've got bad eyesight. This is why I need Laura here. Bent Tom, sorry. Um, I thought at first you think Bent, you can't be that rude, but no, he is. Uh, I just saw my little Gracie. Brilliant, Mike, fab gig, love, and thank you. Thank you. Hi, Gracie, hi. Hi Gracie, get your guitar out. Um, what's it? Tim, oh Tim! Have you been practicing Tim? Have you been practicing this week? Uh, I'm watching you. Um, but Ben, thanks all so much for uh, your support mate, it means a lot to me. Um, do you have any tips for more speed in playing? Um, you know what, I'll do another, I'll, uh, the, when all this kicked off, I did a live stream talking about uh, theory and stuff. And I think um, I'll do another guitar lesson live stream soon as well uh keep an eye out i'll put a note out but getting speed just go slowly to sum it up but i'll show you some tips but look at that stuff or um let's do a scale you want to also practice with clean don't practice with load of gain you know you want to be able to do that on an acoustic you know, so yeah, practice cleanly and slowly. Um, but yes, live acoustic gig would be happening more. BB Ninja, bless you, man, for uh, moderating as always. You are a superstar because you do me, you do that pedal show, you do Michael Guitar Gates, you do a few of us. So you are um, a lovely, lovely soul. You really are. Um, have a lovely couple of weeks. Um, YouTube videos always every Wednesday and simply Wednesday and Friday. I've gone back to two a week, so um, if you haven't seen last one, I posted a video yesterday talk, actually talking about songs and getting your songs out there and stuff like that, so uh, do check it out if you haven't, because um, I quite like that one myself actually, it's a bit of a chatty one, but um, yeah, sharing some ideas about writing a song and then getting it out to the beautiful peoples like yourself, you know, so check out that video, what went up yesterday if you haven't. And there'll be a cool It's a video going up this Wednesday with my D'Angelico guitar. So uh, tune in for that on Wednesday. But, uh, but no, God bless. Stay safe, everyone. And um, hopefully we will make it out the other side very soon. I'm going to have my tie now. I'm going to tap on the door. Oh, Laura's saying goodbye. Oh, she's waving, bless her. She's saying goodbye. We'll see. We're, we're, like I say, thumbs up the video if you want Laura to be on camera for, next, um, for the next one. So now I'll come to camera and turn this off. Uh, thanks all so much for joining me. I will see you very soon. Take care. Mike Bradley signing out. Bye.
and then we come to the camera and then we how do I end it?